Welcome to Coast TV News at 11. Let's talk first about the Indian River Volunteer Fire Company celebrating their way into a milestone. That was the scene today as a parade and party honored the Volunteer Fire Company's 70 years of service. Coast TV's Carmen Holland shows us there's no party without the people who make it all worthwhile. A tip of the hat to a familiar friend on their 70 years in Indian River. That's why Sherry Lee Biel and her family were at today's parade. My son was a member of the Indian River Fire Company. The chaplain for the fire department married my son and daughter-in-law, so it has a special place in our heart. The Indian River Volunteer Fire Company hosted a parade and a party to commemorate this milestone. This is just heaven for them, and the fact that they were throwing out candy from the cars just made it even better. I can't believe that it has been 70 years, especially when we look back at the historical records and see where we came from to where we are today. The parade was full of fire trucks, old and new, from Indian River and surrounding fire companies from Delaware, along with people from the community who walked and watched for support. And the party? Food and music for all. Every fire company should show all the fire departments in the state support. More and more we are all brothers. We work together hand in hand. Indian River says that the support today is just love from family. Everybody's connected in, in one fashion or another, but it's, it's really through brotherhood and service and the fact that most of them have originated their, their volunteers from here at Indian River. And as the Indian River Volunteer Fire Company looks back at 70 years, they know to be ready for what's to come. We have a new facility that, that we need to expand upon and build in, in the Long Neck community, uh, just serving our community to the, to the fullest extent. I wish that they continue on for another 75 years and that everyone in the fire company stay safe. As the Indian River Volunteer Fire Company celebrates their 70 years, they don't want people to forget to come out to their next community breakfast, which will be July 16th, starting at 7.30 a.m., and all proceeds go to the fire company. In Millsboro, I'm Carmen Holland, Coast TV News.